hello what is up you guys welcome back to my channel today happy thursday i think it is i think no it's friday because i know it's friday because i have to work in a few hours and i am gonna cry because it is my first time closing and let me just say like closing at night makes me nervous especially in shopping centers because it's like you know what if i get kidnapped like i'm not saying nobody would want me and nothing but like just the idea of closing as late as we do makes me nervous so i'm very like just i don't want to close but it's okay because i'm gonna have another girl with me so we're all good girls gotta stick together but yeah so anyways hi you guys hello <laughs> how you doing today we are going to be furnishing the university bedroom dorm room whatever you want to call it and i know that a lot of you guys have been looking forward to me furnishing the dorm and i've kind of been pushing it to the side and just sims videos in general because i've had so much going on in my life and so um I'm kind of happy to get this over with because I feel like once this is over everything else will kind of be easy because I'll just be recording university episodes like normal and you know get it in with the flow and also by the way um, I do have you know generations to work on as well I know a lot of you guys have been wondering about generations and I found a house I just need to furnish it so same exact problem I won't be recording it in generations until the house is furnished and uh, could you imagine if I had to build that house how long it would take me like a lot of you guys were like Why don't you build the house? Why don't you build the house? And I was just like girl I don't have time for that and I also can't build and even if I attempted to build it would take me at least a month to get that done I'm just saying I'm being completely honest with y'all and Furnishing this house is gonna take me a long time, too So that's what I'm gonna be doing this weekend furnishing the generations house So hopefully you guys are all good with that I'm gonna try after I you know get this room together to kind of like furnish the um, or upload university episodes i'm sorry i lost my train of thought but anyways so this room is very kind of not simple but it definitely does describe our characters a little bit our sims so if you haven't figured out already i am actually doing sophia's side of the room and sophia is very you know diva ish and she thinks she's just hot crap and <laughs> hot crap that, that's not the right word I should have used. But anyways, she thinks she is just amazing. She is just the best thing since sliced bread. And so I kind of wanted to show that with her room. Her room is definitely a lot different than Katrina's. And you guys will see that once we kind of get into Katrina's bedroom a little bit. But I kind of tried to use these pink slash brown accents because i wanted to have the brown in both aspects of the bedroom because if you've ever been in a dorm room or if you've ever stayed in a dorm with other people um a lot of the time a lot of the furniture is the same and so you have to bring in your own stuff so like the colors of the bed and like the colors of the bed frame and the walls and everything like that I kind of kept the same and then I kind of had this idea of well you know what if Katrina brought in her own stuff you know or not Katrina oh my gosh what if Sophia brought in her own stuff what if she painted her bookshelf what if she you know added in these lights you know because that's just the kind of person she is she kind of goes over overboard with everything that she owns so what if she did you know make a little DIY with the dressers and kind of add that little craziness to it and then if you see Katrina's side that is actually the original style of how things were so Sophia kind of changed it up to make it hers and so that's what a lot of people do in college they like DIY their dressers and like DIY their bed frames and kind of like change things up so that it looks cool or it's more them and that's exactly what Sophia has done Katrina just doesn't care like she's just like I just want to learn I want to go to school and leave like I don't care about all all this but obviously um that's not the case for Sophia so she kind of wanted to have this really crazy looking extravagant nice room and it's exactly what I did I didn't go too crazy because I felt like realistically it is a dorm you can only do so much um, but I did kind of you know as I said represent Sophia in the room so that's kind of just what I'm doing. I did spend more time on Sophia's part of the room than I did on Katrina's. Once I finished, oh, my phone went off. My phone went off. Okay, anyways, once I finished Sophia's side of the room, Katrina's just kind of came naturally. It was just really easy to do. And so 
everything just kind of flowed together yes it did I was so happy I was like oh my god I'm finally done with her room everything else should be a freaking piece of cake and that it was it was a piece of little chocolate cake like it was so easy okay so exactly I just kind of went with a red kind of tone for Katrina's room a mix between like red and blue and black for her room and I kind of you know went a little plain with hers because if you guys didn't know Katrina's aspiration in life is she wants to be a cop and so to be a cop you kind of have to have some type of mask not masculinity that's the wrong word to use what am I saying you have to be athletic I shouldn't have said masculinity I don't even know why that came out of my head I'm tired you guys don't judge me it's really early in the morning okay but to be a cop you kind of have to have some type of athleticism you have to you know be able to do certain things because you know if you you ain't athletic and then it just so happens that you chasing a criminal and he just so happens to beat you then what you gonna do, honey? What you gonna do? Anyways, so yeah, um, that's what I'm doing. And uh, as I said, Katrina's room is a little bit plain. I added like this big rug that I don't even know where it came from. Like I have no clue where this rug came from, but I fit perfectly with the style of her room because I feel like, you know, sometimes when you want your room to be nice, you all you have to do is just add a big rug and it makes such a big difference. So I gave her that. I also put some sports stuff in the corner and then I gave her I think that's a skateboard or something like a whole section of skateboards I'm pretty sure that's a skateboard is it no it's a snowboard but whatever anyway so yeah that's what I did I also gave her one of those little barbells so that she could work out that's not a barbell what is that called I don't know anyways so she could work out she could do her own thing and then we also have like a desk with a computer and things like that that her and Sophia could both share um, even though it is on her side of the room I'm pretty sure that Katrina would not mind sharing with Sophia and this is actually Katrina's computer I thought that it'd be kind of cool to have her have it on her desk so that's exactly what I did and then on this part you can kind of just see me adding in little university posters to kind of like give it its own thing okay so that's pretty much all there is to it I just kind of added some detail and that is where I sort of finished you know I hope you guys enjoyed this video um, as I said I tried to make it as dormy as possible because keep in mind we still are in university I can't make it the most extravagant thing in the world um, but anyways you guys I hope you enjoyed if you did please make sure to give this video a big big thumbs up I love you guys so 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 very much and I shouldn't have to tell y'all okay because y'all should know that I love you all right because y'all just slay my life y'all's the bestest anyways you guys I will catch you all in my very next video. Hope you all have an amazing, amazing, amazing Friday. And um, yeah, bye guys.